All right, YouTube. All right, so this is just a little quick video before I get to the main video. Now, this is something I did catch. Um, I just started recording when I did open up the combo um, with the uh, Gozuki and the Spirit Master. But as you see, I did draw Gold Shark also. So as you can see, I can pretty much do pretty much whatever I want with the play. As you can see, I use Call of the Mummy to special summon Gozuki. Gozuki to get back. I mean, Chief Priest Spirit Master to get back Solitaire and whatnot to tribute just to go in. I said I could I could have either went to the two or the uh to the Unizombie, but Unizombie was clearly better because I could just send the two with Unizombie. But I did make a slight uh, mistake which I can make an adjustment with by just simply going uh sending Mizuki. Now I could have sent Mizuki and that's probably what I should have did it. But you know what it, it doesn't matter because as you can see we pretty much shut up the whole play to, to the way we want it now in hindsight Mizuki is the obviously better option because um, you never know what your opponent might have and you you need something for next turn now granted I do have the two star and stuff like that so um, I'm just saying Mizuki would just be better just in general so as you can see I started off with the, you know they're pretty pretty standard play and now Omega can just return this so now I can use uh, the two star with Sage and pretty much get off all my plays now also, another thing I'm thinking is uh, uh, right here is no matter what he does, I'm not going to take damage and I can at least kill three cards. So with that being said, I'm sitting here waiting, seeing what my opponent's got. I'm like, all right, so, you know, I'm ready for uh, uh, in any deck, um, uh, Metal Foes, anything. That's pretty much what I'm waiting on and stuff like that. But to my surprise, I, well, we don't really get to see what he's playing, but I'm guessing it's a stall deck or something. Um, because the first thing he does is just tribute over both of my monsters and special summons a lava golem So I'm like, all right, you know what? We probably in for some stall, but then I remember I do have the trap set. So that means that um, I can just get rid of this lava golem for free pretty much and a two of his back rows But no, he does he only sets one and then you guys know what one set against me means So that's pretty much over and right here. I decide I want to banish to say uh, the sheer new because I can get back to Chief Priest because all these plays are just set up off the first turn Gozuki and what's the name? Bam. Add that back. And as you see, um, I drawn to a twin sorcerer, but that does not matter. As you can see, I'm checking this graveyard. I was just seeing what I hit. So as you can see, look, bam, I could easily um omega I can omega and put back something. I can use a two-star to banish the sage. But I thought, you know what? It's better to banish the Smith because if we banish the Smith. That means when we do get Chief Priest back and get the Sage back, we can special summon two. Uh, we can special summon, we can get a search and we can get two more monsters because we do have the trap card, which count as reincarnation. So that means Sage special summons two monsters back. Um, it, they special summon, it special summons two monsters back. So that means that we're just we're just grind, we're just going and going. But look, that's that's the, but then that's what I was thinking about with. Call of the Mummy. That's what I'm thinking about with the interaction with Gozuki and stuff because it just it leads to it leads basically it leads to just more plays because it's just an extra free summon which is good. Now uh, I just yeah so yeah that's pretty much the only thing I really wanted to say with this. Um, I just randomly caught this like I was just going on to play, and then I did I like I opened up the combo so you know what, let's record it let me see what I can do. As you see, my my opponent rage quits here after when I do this to shuffle back to draw to draw a card. So do I even get to see the card? Yes. Okay. So I drew into that. So now it's just even better. I can just search another chief priest or something like that. But yeah, man, that was just a little combo video and whatnot to pretty much uh, explain what I was thinking about with Call of the Mummy being in the deck. So you know that this just my little thoughts now. That would that's just this now we're going to get into the regular video So I hope you guys did enjoy these replays and if you like something like this Or if you want me to do uh, more things like this like little short videos and stuff. I can definitely do that So yeah, thank you and um, yeah, uh, get ready to watch the video uh, And I'm out. All right. What is up YouTube? Hope you guys did enjoy the uh, that little replay I did put before this um, Just that was just a little replay I caught after I got done filming but yeah today uh, like I said, uh, I, I did go with the um, higher, uh, I guess, the higher um, level, even though it's not really that much of a replacement because I only took out a couple of cards. As you can see, I only took out the Bone Crusher and the Leon Cholius. 
with the return cards. Now, this is not to say these cards are bad. Once again, we're just testing. This is not so much of a high, you know, like I said, like a high attack. Just zombies that are special summonable and are just strong. Red Ogre only triggers when it's normal summon. So, I was like, no, nah, that's kind of ass. So, I just decided to go with Ill Blood and Endless Decay. And then I also added to Sheer New Synthesis. And only put one in because it is searchable. And it's like, you know, <clears throat> it, it is a decent card, but it's not the best to open up with because you need to control no monsters. And then their effects, I mean, the effects of the field card relies on if your deck is already getting getting a, get, uh, going and uh, pretty much already got shit set up. This is this is why this card, I'm just going to put it at one just to see it right now. Now, I was, um, would probably put a vampire card or something, but that it's everything I looked at it was like, okay, well. These are obviously the two best <clears throat> zombie monsters because this just gains half the your opponent's life points. And also, you can use Synthesis to special summon it. Um, and it's just like 4,000 on your first first run or like we'll call them on you or something like that. In the, in, and then you can also use Reincarnation to put them back and draw a card now. Um, yeah, so that's pretty much um, Decay's, I guess. I, I don't I don't even know like these are only two good um <laughs> high level zombies I can really I, I really I seen so um yeah uh you, if you guys don't know what Ill Blood does this is pretty much a um Gigavice and if you don't know what Gigavice does it pretty much uh when uh you, once per turn you could just spell summon a zombie from your hand or graveyard but if this card if Ill Blood leads the field you got to destroy all the zombie type monsters spell something by the card so this just adds like if you go first turn call the mummy. Bam, you can just summon this and get something else out. And then you can get, you can go like to the, you can summon Sage, get the two star, sync, and then bam, you have an Omega play. Or you could go, um, Yuta Zombie, send a Mizuki, um, leave this on a board for next turn and go into something that just protected. I don't know. It's, 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 a, it's, a, it's a decent card. Like I said, this is pretty much the testing phase. I'm sorry for, uh, uploading the video late. Um, this is the first time I got home and it's like 141 right now as the recording. So after, after I get done, I'm just immediately upload it. So it's probably going to be around three o'clock. You guys are seeing this video probably or a little earlier than that. Depends on how long this video goes. It's probably going to be around three o'clock or two thirty or something like that. But yeah, that is enough talking. Um, let's just get straight into the duels and see what these cards can do. All right, so we are in our first duel. Hopefully it is recording. It, yeah, it looks like it's recording. Um, yeah, hope we are in our first duel. And uh, sorry if you do hear the heater in the background. It is uh, very cold. Very, very cold. Now, I don't know what this hand entails, but it doesn't entail anything good at all. This is not the greatest of hands, but you know what? We can do something with this. We can actually do a pretty decent play. Sadly, we're not going to be left, I believe, with anything. Yeah, we should not be left with um, a zombie on the board. So that sucks. Uh, we could send ill blood, but that'd be stupid. Um, Mizuki is obviously the best choice for this. Um, yeah, so uh, what I'm thinking is going to... Okay, what I'm this is what I'm thinking, all right, you guys? Um, go Omega, bam. Then go Bushi. Banish the Bushi, right? And then add back that for my twin twister. I mean, banish the samurai. Samurai gets me back to solitaire. And then now I have I have fodder for my twin twister and my slash. Now I don't want to set two because I, you know, my, my opponents love to have a uh, twin twister. But you know what? I'm going to set two. We're gonna we're gonna try to get our opponent. Hopefully he's playing some type of uh, pendulum deck so we can just hit it. Um, you know, hopefully he's not playing anything too crazy where he just an OTK me. Because that wouldn't be a good duel. But to why my opponent takes his time to do whatever he does. Pot of Desire. So he's most likely probably playing Paleozoics because he just started off without activating nothing. Um, yeah. Uh, so yeah, I like to say why my opponent is doing what he is doing. That uh, Let's see what, what he has. I would like to say if you guys do enjoy this video... Definitely leave a like. Um, if you guys let me know what you think of the video by leaving a comment. Um, <clears throat> also subscribe. I upload Monday, Wednesday, and Friday at one. We're usually at one. Whoa, sir! What are you doing? 
What are you doing? What are you doing, sir? Yay! And he has the sage. No, he does not have the sage. Okay, so that's pretty good. Oh, he doesn't have anything. Okay, so we can just go ahead and put this on normal. Okay, there we go. Oh, and we have the Mizuki, so what can we do? Oh, I know what we can do, and this is going to be fun. But then we're not going to be able to attack with... Uh... What do you do? Okay, that's cool. But, uh, wait, what? What does that say? Does he get an effect? Okay, during your opponent's turn. Okay, so bam, we can do this. All right. Send the, oh, do we attack? I think we attack first. Um, yeah, let's attack first. Let's just get this damage in because we're not going to do any more damage. I think I don't think we have any way to OTK him, so that was uh, out of the bag. <clears throat> we could send Gozuki. I, I, I was wondering, like, what the fuck are they asking me to do? We could send Gozuki. Use Gozuki to banish the solids here. Special this. And then this gets me back this. I really thought we was going to be able to synchro with this for some odd reason. Now, we can go another Omega. Ooh, shit. That's, no, I think. You know what? Let's go start this charge word because we still do have a normal summon. So if we do draw a, a zombie, hopefully not ill blood. Oh, no, we do go Zuki, which is the best top deck I could have. And then now I could send Mizuki, right? And then sink into another Omega. Go bam. And see, then now I could just, you know what? I feel real confident. I feel very confident, even though I just completely fumbled that. I should not go Crystal Wing because if since I'm going Crystal Wing, he's now going to be able to get over it with his Bushi or his Samurai. So I should be able to look at his banish, but I will not be able to because this is Death Pro, which is crazy because Omega says a card. It doesn't specifically say, uh, and I really shouldn't do it because he does have Breakthrough Scale in his graveyard. Yeah. Okay. That's. Not something I would have did, but hey, I can't make him do what he wants to do. Um, he's probably going to summon Bushi. Pretty sure he's summoning Bushi. Oh, wow, he's doing this again, which is, which is pretty bad. Let's see what he gets through. Nope. No, Tyrant Neptune. What the fuck is Tyrant Neptune even doing in his deck? I don't know what he's going for. What are you doing? You could have easily just popped it. You could have did massive amount of damage. To, I mean, unless you have a fire dark arm. Well, might as well activate it because you never know. But, uh, <clears throat> yeah, like I was saying, if you guys do, uh, I do upload Monday, Wednesday, and Friday at 1 p.m. Today, um, uh, I just wasn't home in time. Uh, it's not like I, I, I didn't, you know, didn't want to record. It's just I just didn't make it home in time to upload on the thing. But you guys are still getting a video today. So that should be pretty good. Um, okay, so what we can do now, we can do a lot, actually. So we can do this uh, Gozuki thing, right? Oh, wow, we can do a whole bunch of plays. Or we're gonna actually no, he's playing he's playing zombies, so I don't think we should do too much plays. We're gonna do some nice plays, but we're not gonna do too much. Okay, um, we're not gonna over. Oh, can we special from his graveyard? Oh, from either player's graveyard. That is so fucking busted. Oh man, that's so good. Uh, see, look, I can get anything now. I can even get from his graveyard. Uh, that's pretty good. We're gonna get this. I don't know why, but I just did. Um, it's 
See, bro. They mean, everybody's it, it, pretty good. But yeah, man. Uh, I upload Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. So you guys do get three videos a week and whatnot. Uh, also, click add to help support the channel, which would be very good uh, for me, for the channel, and stuff like that. And it would be very appreciative. So I would thank you guys if you can do that. I know that took a long time to get through. And um, yeah, we're already, what, no? Plus the little four minute video before. So we're about 14 minutes in. 15 minutes in, oh, let's get another door. And while I really love, uh, or I really would love a pyramid turtle, I just think that it would just be too slow. It would be too slow for this deck. Um, it would be too slow for us. Now this is once again, the fucking perfect combo, but we needed a gold star. But we are playing Garen Demazia. So let's see what we can do. Nope, don't need that twin twist to resolve him. Uh, hold on real quick. All right, so here we go with the Call of the Mummy plays. And once, it, dude, I pressed ignore chain. Now, I'm, I'm going to just set it. I think that's just the best thing to do is to set it because I, I hate when they ask me, do I want to, what's the name? Do I keep one to do it? All right, so, ooh, we could send it. Now that'd be stupid. So here we go with the Spirit Master. The Spirit Master into the Sage, which is just so, it's so good with this Call of the Mummy play. This is an extra normal summon. Stick of it is my brain infusion. So we're going to get you. Now, what do we send? That's the whole thing. Um, we do have a soul charge. So. Um, could just send this and then just soul charge for all of them. I think that might just be a better play. Um. But no, I, I believe there's something better than that. Um, no, that's, that's it. Be right back. All right, so we are back against Austin. Yeah, I got, I got it right the first time. Jesus Christ. Um, ooh, this is actually pretty decent, I guess. Uh, all right, so what do we send? That's the whole thing. We could send this. Right, we could send this, or we can send. We can send Sage. I think Mizuki might be our best answer, even though that's a it's pretty. You no, know, yeah, Mizuki is just clearly the better, the best choice to do. Because what I was thinking was, um, I can Icarus, and then, but that this would miss timing. What do you do? Um, what does it say? Ancient gear monsters cannot be targeted or destroyed during the turn. They're normal summer and special summer. Your opponent cannot of an ancient gear card. Shit. So that might be a problem. I think I need to do it now. I'm so fucking scared though. I have to do it. Wait, what happens? I have to do it now. I have to do it now. There's just, there's just, there's no waiting. There's no waiting. If he, uh, see now, now this is the hard choice. What do I banish? I think the two stars just, yeah, two stars obviously the best answer. Um, he does not have an ancient gear in hand, so that's that's a good thing. Uh, okay. Um, he quit, and the reason why I knew he didn't have an ancient gear is because he didn't activate the effect. And then uh, in real life, I would have, you know, asked. I don't know why I'm explaining that. It really just didn't make any sense. Instant luck had some instant loss. This is fucking bad. Holy crap, this is bad. Is it? It's very bad. I thought I was going to be able to do a different play, but I'm not able to. Um, I, think, I, I, I thought Book of Life was just a monster reborn and whatnot. Holy shit, we're going up against Metal Foles. Uh oh, ass whipping ensuing. Is there an ass whipping ensuing? I think so. I think so. No, it's Master Pendulum. Okay, so we're playing against the uh the uh the, the prefer wait a minute, we might be playing against that new goddamn uh what is it? No, it is, it is Metal Falls, so I'm not understanding the painful decision. Unless he already has the one in the eight scale, and so that's what I'm going to go ahead and believe because he did that play. Um I believe he already has the one in the eight scale, but yeah, man, the OCG ban list came out, and I don't know why it took me so long to get into it. Do you have a fucking eccentric? 
That's even better. That's even better. Um, but still, it's not showing me no bambuku and shit. Karen is banned, which is the greatest thing to happen since Gozuki coming out. I don't, I don't even know how to explain. Karen got banned. That was a terrible play. But he just did. That shit was bad. What the hell was this? Instant luck? You did all that for a 1950 monster? See, now I'm going to I'm gonna piss, I'm gonna piss on you right now, man. Please don't get a counter. I don't want to deal with counter. Oh, fuck. There goes the counter. Um, I need a twin twister. And I don't play. Damn it. I took out Bone Crusher. Well, that's actually pretty decent. Now, what I can do is I can Black Rose. And I think that is going to go ahead and be the play. I think Black Rose is the best play to do. I think it is. I think it is. I think it is. And he might have multiple cards down there. And I don't think there's anything I can do about that. Ooh, but I do have a great play. Hmm. I think I want to send... See, I want Gozuki. Because I can send Goblin Zombie and get Gozuki. But what would that entail? Because I still do have... No, I won't have a Mizuki. But I will have a Call of the Mummy to get back. I mean, special on the Gozuki. Gozuki can send something. That just wouldn't be good. I just, I just, I can't. Wait a minute. Time out. Because I can go Black Rose. Search Endless Decay Special. That's 57 I can do. But I can't do any more. So I don't think that would be the best option. I think Send In the Smith is just, I think that's just the best option here. So we can Black Rose him. All right? We can Black Rose him. And then we just we just have to search the trap card because he does have counter, so <clears throat> we have to worry about that. And there it goes with the automatic timing. Um, we can search this. What did you have in here? Oh, four to the two Dracos. Okay, so that means this is fabulously bad. I didn't normal summon, so I didn't need to do this. I don't know why I did that. That was just stupid. Um, I've actually no, because I already used. Okay, no, there's not. It, it. I think the Goblin Zombie play should would have been better. But the fact that he has a counter, that's the only thing I'm scared of. What's the counter? That's the only. Th <clears throat> Excuse me, shit. My voice is going away. The only thing I was scared of was the counter. I didn't want the counter to resolve. Um, I knew he had it set, so that was the whole thing, and I knew he's gonna be able to have two scales. So I don't, I don't think I just have to, I have to face my fears. If he has Karen, he has Karen. There's nothing I can do about that. If he has Karen, he has Karen. But um, I don't think I'm gonna unless it's something. Okay, wait. What did he add back? No system checkup. I don't want you right now. Okay, now here, here, here might be a thing. What'd you add back? Is that what he got back off of this? I think so. And then, yeah, it was only. Shit. Um, wait, wait, why would I negate that? What the fuck am I thinking about? That was. <laughs> I'm sitting here worried about something that I literally do not have to negate. No, I don't, I don't care. Yeah, that was dumb. Instant luck. What the fuck were you doing? Oh, yeah, that was really stupid. You knew I searched the trap card. You literally knew I searched the trap card. Why would you do this? He said, I can't believe you have done this. Like, what the fuck was that? Instant luck. You knew my whole play. You knew I searched the trap card. And now this Call of Mummy is really finna put in some work. Like now you, your whole play, your whole play is that wow what what the fuck was that?
Now I know what has to happen. That was a card I'd, I'd like to see. What is in here? Hmm. Um, I can go into a... I can go into a Shogun Saga. Fuck. This is hard. Uh, you know, I think I just have to go for game. Yep, I think that is the... I think that is the de facto thing I have to do. I think I just have to go for game, everybody. I think that's just what it's going to have to be. No, we don't want to know what's on that. No special summon. Um, okay. I didn't I didn't understand that, bro. What were you doing, instant luck? So we're gonna get you. Alright. Ooh, we could oh shit, we could have did that, huh? To you to get you. It doesn't look like he has anything. I hope he doesn't. I hope it's not like a, a drowning because I'm just be. I'm gonna just start crying. Uh, send the Mizuki. I'm going to the Mizuki by getting the Smith. Uh, we can go Shogun Saga. You said Shogun Saga's effect. To banish the could have also banished the uh, the sage. That's not gonna matter right now. Then we're gonna normal summon this. Thanks to thanks to Call of the Mummy being Call of the Mummy, get you out. Now we're gonna go start his charge word because we do want an extra card. Uh oh, he lost connection. Now Sage was gonna get back. <clears throat> Sage was gonna get back uh, Bushi, and then we was gonna be able to attack. Now that was not the safest route I could have went, but you know what? I just wanted to be flashy, be you know, you know, just to do a little something, something. So that is it for that. Let's get one more duel, and then so I can get this video out to you guys. So oh, shit, did I press? I already started the video. He didn't even accept the match. All right, there we go. All right, I can put that down. Um, <clears throat> shit. I don't know what the hell is going on. I don't know if it's because of the weather. What the hell are we playing? Monarchs? He has zero extra deck. Ooh, this is good. This is really good. This is fucking beautiful. Okay. <laughs> oh my god. This is amazing. Yo, yo, folks. Yo, folks. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ, folks. Jesus Christ, folks. He's probably going to quit. Look at the hand. That shit was ridiculously good. So now we, we can go Omega and get a free search. And we're probably going to grab Gozuki. Um, probably. Oh shit, I was going to send Gozuki like right now because I was like, where the hell is my goblin zombie? It was already in a graveyard. That's why this hand was amazing. This is exactly why this hand was great. So now we can go Omega. I hope I picked Omega. There we go. Now, what do I want to search is the whole thing. Uh, oh, I said I was going to grab Gozugi. So that is that is exactly what we're grabbing. And then we're going to use you to banish you. Don't need to chain, chain that. We're going to get the Revive King. Then we're going to use Solitaire to get you out. I believe we're going to go Crystal Wing. I believe we're going to go Crystal Wing. Oh, we can go another Omega. Because uh, Omega is cool. I uh, have a Mizuki Banished. I think Omega might be the best answer, actually. Um, Is it? Yeah. You know what I am? I'm going to go double Omega. Because well, why not? That is just... <clears throat> it's so good to just go double omega and we, we we still have five so i mean we didn't plus but we didn't neg either which is good and um we do we are getting two extra cards back and these are just 
These are just fodder for um, next turn. All right, he surrendered. Okay, I figured that was going to happen. Yeah, so all right, so we're going against an income poop, and let's not, let's hope that we're not an income poop and draw very badly. We have not seen really none of the text. Um, this is this is pretty good. Uh, I can chief priest into this tribute. Could go Zuki send something. Um, hmm, what is it? I mean, it's obviously solitaire is a better play. Um, but sometimes you know I like to I like to keep it suspenseful. Wow, I could have did a whole entirely different play. Um, okay, definitely could do that. That That is pretty good. Is it? Hmm. Um, what I can do, kid you not, is I could ditch the Unizombie, right? And then ditch a uh, single Zuki from the deck to banish Uni. Special summon Gozuki to send another card. That's that's literally. Is that doing too much? It is. It is probably doing too much. And now I understand what people were. Or what's the name? Somebody left a comment saying, "Why don't I just tribute the Spirit Master?" And for some reason, I thought I was going to be left with a monster on board. But you know what? I could play it off. I could play it off. You know why? Because I could just use this, right? And just play it off like I'm. Ooh, oh, nope, don't have another. What's the name? I can play it off like I'm just getting something back. I'm just getting something back because if I do have nothing else banished besides uh, the sage, which I really don't want in my graveyard. So I can play it off like that. But now, I, okay, I understand that. I mean, it's just, it's literally the same thing as just. Yeah, it's literally the same thing. It's the same thing as tributing this because then that's the end result. You still have. The Spirit Master on board at the end of the turn. Um, okay. You're already setting cards. I mean, you're trying to either dodge my Omega. Okay, so now I'm just going to wait. Because now this is the perfect time to do it. Okay, so let's see. Let's see what he activates. Oh, we're going up against some weird deck. If he activates any of these cards. Um, okay, well, I think I have to. I think I have to. I think that's just necessary. Let's see what the last two were. Ooh, the Phoenix Chain, the Pinpoint Guard. Uh, is this just the best banish? Yep, let's just banish that. Draw into ooh, a decay. That's pretty good. Um, that's really good. That is really, really good. So what we're going to do? We're going to normal some of this. Nope, don't need to do anything to that. Did I miss the torrential? Don't do that to me. Don't do the torrential to me. We have game. Well, we have game right now. Yep, this is a game. This is game. Uh, we could just go moonlight. I don't. I don't, I don't care about that. Oh, not. Oh, it's, it's. Oh shit! This is a major league game now. I don't understand what that whole play, what he just did was. Um, do we even need to go into another Omega? I mean, to be on the safe side, I guess we'll go into another Omega. Just to be on the safe side. Now, we literally could have went Shogun Saga also. And this was still the would be game. Wait, did I use this? Okay. All right, well, we're going to go double Omega just to be cautious and safe. But this is why Gozuki is actually good. Actually good. Yeah, we still had game no matter what. Did he quit? No, he didn't. Um, yeah, we're going to use Solitaire's Effect to get you back. So, yeah, we, we still had game regardless. Um, but, yeah, this is why I, like, I would like Gozuki and shit. With these high level, I mean high attack zombies, is because of shit like this. It's just immediately game. Like we just put a four thousand beater on, like while sending Mizuki, which is crazy, and going into a level eight. That's just really good. That's this. This is why um, I actually like the high level. So yeah, that is it for today. Once again, sorry for the late upload. Uh, like I said, man, uh, just didn't make it home in time. 
uh, next week, uh, <clears throat> I definitely would uh, most likely 90, 95% sure that I will be uploading every day at 1 p.m. I mean, not every day, but Monday, Wednesday, and Friday at 1 p.m. So you guys definitely is going to get three videos at one. So I hope this really doesn't bother you too much. But yeah, man, sorry for the late upload today. But yeah, that is it for today. Thank you guys for watching. I appreciate it and whatnot. And uh, uh, thank you guys for subscribing. And, you know, everybody who's been subscribing, everybody's leaving comments, suggestions and stuff. Thank you, man. I really appreciate it. So yeah, but that is the end of the video today. Um, yeah, so I guess I'll see you guys next week. And as always... Um, if you guys do enjoy the content, definitely leave a like. Also, leave a comment. Let me know what you think about the video and the deck. And if you guys have any decks or any stuff that you want to see me play or try out or something like that, that would definitely be good. Um, also, subscribe if you have not. I upload Monday, Wednesday, and Friday at 1. Today was a, a little a little setback, but, you know, it is cool. It's only, what, it should, should be around 3 o'clock you guys are seeing this. Um, so, yeah, uh, I upload Monday, Wednesday, and Friday at one o'clock usually um you guys get three videos a week and whatnot and also if you guys can click that to help support the channel which would be great and helpful in all that jazz so yeah thank you see you guys next week so if i don't get a deck list you know what i might play skull servants with gozuki just because somebody left a comment and i know that shit is crazy because gozuki is just gonna send white prints and then that shit's just gonna be amazing. And like you can literally just banish like one of the little white princes and shit and bring out another zombie, which you can bring out another you could bring out like white princess and white princess sends another white prince. And then you can just you see what I'm sorry, you could just drop King of the Skull Servants or something like that. So yeah. Um <clears throat> probably gonna be playing that. Maybe playing some more of this if I come up with something different or if somebody sends me something different. Yeah, so yeah, thank you guys for watching and I will see you guys on Monday.